started with IDA when I was two years old. I was put into this program to start off with self-confidence, um, to build up just core strength and put in a safe place where I can be me. In 2021, Riding for the Disabled Victoria celebrates 50 years of providing equine assisted therapies and activities for people with disabilities. RDA Knox was one of 237 projects that were picked for the Pick My Project funding. It got a generous and sizeable grant and it's enabled what was an eight year dream of Catherine's to become a reality. It means that we can relieve our waiting list. We do have quite a significant wait list for Metropolitan Melbourne. Uh, it can be up to four years. We will be able to take on riders from now and relieve those waiting lists. And over time, we'll be able to expand the programs. A lot of our riders, it's a social benefit. They come out, they're part of a program, they're part of a community. And there's also a lot of riders that it's therapeutic. Uh, be it whether they're autistic or whether they've got a physical disability, there's benefits in riding that's provided to them. So I'm aiming for one of the Paralympics in 2024 and 2028. And with Pathways leading from RDA, this dream has now become a goal. It's a great bunch of people that you're always surrounded with. It made me such a confident young person. Having this little aspect here enables riders from this side of town to experience what I've experienced, come out and start their own new memories, start their own new creations, start their own new goals. And it's that step away from town where they can be just who they want to be.